Proverbs chapter 11, verses 1 through 6. God hates cheating in the marketplace. He loves it when business is above board. The stuck up fall flat on their faces, but down to earth people stand firm. The integrity of the honest keeps them on track. The deviousness of crooks brings them to ruin. A thick bankroll is no help when life falls apart, but a principled life can stand up to the worst. Moral character makes for smooth traveling. An evil life is a hard life. Good character is the best insurance. Crooks get trapped in their sinful lust. Father, Oh, how I love the way you map things out for easy comparison. You point out in several comparisons that it is best to be open and honest with you as well as everyone else. You promise to love honest business, help people to stand firm that have abandoned pride, keep the honest on track, help the principled life stand when trouble comes, smooth out the path for a moral character, and provide escape for a good character. I am reminded of the joke that I'm sure you have heard. <laughs> a man decides to become a painter. As things progress, he realizes that he can add thinner to the paint and it will go much further and thereby he can make more money. One day, the preacher calls and asks him to paint the outside of the church. His mind races at the thought of adding more thinner and making a killing. So he proceeds with his plan so enthusiastic that he finishes the job in one day. That night, a big rainstorm came and washed all of the thinned paint off the church. The next morning, the preacher calls and says, Repaint and thin no more. This is a funny example of a very serious issue. Deviousness brought the painter to ruin. His crooked path trapped him in his sinful lust. While each of us is our own character, which is sometimes confused with personality traits, you are very much about developing character. You long for us to walk upright with you and with mankind. Today, guide me in business. Keep me down to earth regarding walking in true humility. Lead me in integrity and a principled life so no matter what comes my way, I can stay on track and stand up to the worst. Continue to develop a good moral character that truly walks in sowing and reaping the goodness and favor you shower me with every moment, every day. Thank you for your simple direction as you open your word and help me hear your voice. Amen.